Holy cow. This is the craziest storm I've ever been in in my life. Let's do the honors. It's hot. All right, today we're gonna be making a very fancy Italian dish. It's relatively simple, but since I'm in a French province, I thought it would be fun to get as crazy with it as we can. Um, if you go to like a fancy Italian restaurant, sometimes they cook this dish inside of a cheese wheel. Go on my eye, please. We're trying to find a cheese wheel today and cook some pasta. It's basically the, it's basically the gist of it. I also gotta drive a few hours. Finally leaving Montreal. Hi. Could I have a uh, iced coffee? I can do an iced Americano or an iced latte. Iced Americano sounds good. Perfect. You guys don't have croissants, do you? No, unfortunately. Not Sorry. yet. We will, though. Okay, sounds good. There you are. Thank you very much. Have a great time on Toronto. Yeah, thank you. I took every bone in my body not to say you two. <laughs> I guess I could have said you two. It would have made sense. All right, here we are the Atwater Market. Massif Atwater. This is one of the bigger markets here in Montreal. Um, so we're gonna try to see if we can't find an adequate cheese wheel here first. Look at this basil plant. I don't think I'm gonna find a cheese in there, but it's impressive. Makes me wish I was at home, plant some stuff in the garden, I guess. Can't really plant a garden in a truck. Bonjour. Uh, could I have one of your spaghettis? One spaghetti? Yep. Anything else? That'll be it. Thank you very much. How's it going? Good and you. Good. I'm looking for like a small cheese wheel uh, to make a uh, cock. Forgive me, I don't know how to say it. Caco de Pepe? Uh, Cassio, how do you say it? Yeah, yeah. Like Parmesan or something similar? Do you sell something like that? We sell Parmesan. Oh, you just sell them in slices. I see. So you don't even have a full wheel intact? Maybe the butt. Okay. Like, what's really expensive? Oh, so 50 to 100 times that's like $1,200? Something like that. It's a huge size. It's huge, huge? Okay. Do you know anywhere that would sell something that is like a medium Small size? Parmesan wheel. Or like a medium one? No? It might be hard to find. Okay. I don't know anything. Like Alright, thank you. Hmm. Thousand dollars for cheese wheel. Have you ordered already? I will check your tickets here. I don't have a number, I was just gonna order. Ah, thank you. Bonjour. Can I just do a chocolate croissant? Yeah, of course. All right, thank you. Have a good day. Thank you, you too. So sick. Fresh fruits, flowers. We struck out on cheese. The only reason is because I'm kind of scared of having it unrefrigerated on this really hot day uh, and driving. So we're going to try to find somewhere closer to where we camp to pick up a wheel of cheese that expensive if we do. We got our pasta though, we got some coffee and then my guilty pleasure, a chocolate croissant. Another thing worth mentioning is that my freezer, or my refrigerator has been freezing absolutely everything. So I don't really trust it with a big wheel of cheese right now either. So today we're finally leaving Montreal. I very much enjoyed my time here, but I got a blast. Oh my God. Mm! Right now we're heading to Quebec City. It's about a three hour drive from Montreal. 
and is apparently somehow more romantic. In the grand scheme of things, this city seems pretty romantic to me, but... Mercy. <clears throat> they might not have had a wheel of cheese, but they had good looking cheeseburgers, so and here we are. Is it gonna storm? Oh Lord. Le Grand, Le Grand Marche. Next stop, Le Grand Marche. If I could speak any other language, I would be stealing your ladies. Bro, this is so much rain. Where did this come from? How long is the rain? What the hell? It's so nice out. So I'm at the second market of the day. Basically just looking for cheese, but I don't see any yet. I see a lot of other cool things, just no cheese. Like a medium sized like parmesan wheel. I wanted to make pasta in a parmesan? cheese dough. Yeah. yeah. I wanted to make it but in a cheese dough. It's not like a wheel. Yeah, yeah. It's like that. Okay. Right. Do you have like a half of a wheel? Yeah. Or I, can, you I can give you a. Or like a, like a half of a wheel? No, I don't have. No. No. Okay. no. Is there anywhere that would be around here that you think I could get like a wheel of cheese at? I a wheel of cheese? Yeah. Oh, I don't think so. No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe in the restaurant. Okay. Hey, thank you. Oh no, that's not good. So I'm making like a pasta dish in a wheel. And so I want to make sure I'm not wasting a bunch of cheese. Obviously I don't want to buy a big 40 kilo thing of cheese and- Thank you, so what did I 135? Yep. Oh, beautiful. So that's for the whole wheel? Yep. All right, and that one's milder and kind of has the same consistency as Parmesan? Almost, yes. Yeah. Maybe a bit- um, Less, less what, sorry? Less dry. Less dry, okay. Maybe okay. okay, I'll do that then, that sounds awesome. Thank oh you, my, you thank you so much. To, yeah, um, thank you both very much. Yeah. Have a wonderful evening. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Sounds good. Leave me a comment. <laughs> Bye. I didn't think it was going to happen tonight, honestly. But we got cheese. It's not Parmesan, but they said it's milder tasting than Parmesan. Maybe it's going to be a little bit more uh, moist, a little less dry. So we'll see how well it uh, it works for this type of application. But... They're so nice. They gave me a, uh, a wire to cut it with. They offered to cut it for me in there, but I kind of wanted to try myself, so. That's not a bad sight to look at. Well, this just popped up on my phone. Um, let's see what it says. Take cover immediately if threatening weather approaches. That kind of switched up. 
Should I save the cheese for another day and just worry about surviving? I was kind of kidding before about making it out alive, but I'm actually serious now. This is this is the craziest storm I've ever been in in my life. This is crazy, dude. Alrighty then. Yeah, that's good. It's great, actually. Love that. Well, I think we celebrate our survival with a Parmesan wheel. The kind people at that cheese shop offered to cut this cheese for me, but I said, no, no, for entertainment value, I will, I will cut this myself. So they decided to lend me, well, they gave me a wire. They didn't lend it to me. They gave this to me. Very kind of them. So we're going to try our worst at cutting the cheese. Is the car level? No, it's not. Have I ever cut cheese before? Absolutely not. I don't know how to do this. This is not simple. Yeah, that's not easy. I should have them cut this. <laughs> no way, fam. No way. We did it. Let's freaking go. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. That's some good cheese. Yum. Quite nice. Bussin! I don't know how much of this cheese I want to take out. We gotta make a bowl, though. Good thing that rat's still not living here. He'd be in heaven. That's probably good enough for a bowl. I feel like I should put some pants on. I'm like self-conscious that you guys can see my legs, to be honest. Yes. Cacio, cacio y pepe. All right, that's enough. We got a nice boil going on the water. To take our fresh spaghetti from the Montreal market. And I'm gonna use my blowtorch. There we go. This looks so good, dude. Still don't know how to properly pronounce this right but we'll just call it Pepe. Let's do the honors. I can die happy now. That's it. That's all, we, that's all she wrote. I think the presentation is making it taste even better, but it's just, it's so simple, but so good. There's a nice creaminess from the butter and pasta water. Um, that pasta water helped break up some of the cheese that was on the outside. I don't know what else to say, man. So good. I was gonna make myself the second serving, but honestly, man, I'm about to be in a food coma. I'm gonna wrap up this cheese. Put this in here.
we survived a tornado and we made a great pasta dish um always room for improvement probably could learn to make it a little more authentic but that's with most things that i do so as always until next time you're in the drill just keep on trucking